Our family is very close, very close, and a part of us is missing that we can never get back. Lori Friend lost her only son, Megan Friend, her baby brother, when Ryan Friend, riding his motorcycle north on Nova Road September 25th, was broadsided by the driver of a pickup truck as the truck driver crossed Nova heading east on Miles Drive. They didn't take the time to thoroughly investigate it. There was witnesses that stated different. It's like it didn't matter to anybody. You know, you could run across all of that and kill somebody. He attempted to cross over from that stop sign. Lori Friend says witnesses told her the pickup driver rolled through a stop sign, then gunned it into the median, colliding with Ryan on his motorcycle. The 22-year-old thrown from the bike. But the truck driver was only charged with failure to yield, a $166 ticket. In a statement released to West 2 by Port Orange Police, they said their investigation did not reveal any elements of reckless driving on the part of the pickup truck driver and that he did not exhibit signs of impairment. Loved ones are not optimistic about changing the outcome of the police investigation, but they'll continue working to change future outcomes at this intersection, one they consider inherently dangerous. We've learned there have been more than a dozen crashes here in recent years, and Ryan Friend's mother thinks that warrants, at the very least, additional signage. There's 12 different directions you can, you can turn at this one intersection. That's just way too much going on in this intersection. She expects to be joined by many others this weekend at a protest demanding change. This had a fatality. How much more important does it have to get? In Port Orange, Volusia County, Claire Metz, West 2 News.